Hello everyone, I'm very excited to share with you this new version of Hum's family of models. They have just come up with an array of Hum's three models, which is covering various flavors of Llama 3.1, 8 billion, 405 billion and 70 billion model. In this video, we are going to install the full Hum's 3 Llama 3.1, 8 billion model locally and then we are, are going to test it out on various benchmarks. I already have been covering this Herms model on my channel for the last various months and more often than not, I have found them very high quality, especially when it comes to reasoning and role playing and we are also going to test the same for this new Herms model. And by the way, as a fun fact, Herms is a Greek messenger god and he is a patron god of commerce, thieves and travelers and is associated with speed, communication and guidance. So it is quite an interesting god and if you go through the Greek mythology, you will be fascinated to learn many qualities and it is really really interesting to read. But anyway, let's try to get this model installed locally and then we will see how it works. Before I do that, let me give a huge shout out to Mast Compute who are sponsoring the VM and GPU for this video. If you are looking to rent a GPU on affordable prices, I will drop the link to their website in video's description. Plus, I am also going to give you a coupon code of 50% discount on range of GPUs. Okay, so this is my terminal where I am running Ubuntu 22.04 and I have one GPU card NVIDIA RTX A6000 with 48GB of VRAM. Let me clear the screen. Let's create a conda environment where we will be keeping everything separate. I'm just calling it hums. Let's wait for it to finish. It is going to create the conda environment and activate it. And that is all done. Let me now install all the prerequisites which include torch, transformers, accelerate. Let's wait for it to get finished. Now, meanwhile, these prerequisites get installed. Let's go back to the hums and try to see a bit more technical information about this model. So it is the latest version of their flagship hum series of LLMs by Naus Research. It is a generalist language model with many improvements over hums too, including advanced agentic capabilities, much better role playing, reasoning, multi ten conversation, long context coherence, and improvement across the board. Also, um, the real core of these sort of models, the hums I mean, is a focus on aligning LLMs to the user with powerful steering capabilities and control given to the end user. So this hums 3 builds on top of hums 2 set of capabilities and especially when it comes to structured output capabilities, generalist assistant capabilities and improved coding skills it really shines through and that is what we are going to test it out in this video it uses chat ml a prompt also even in some cases it has shown greater performance than the original llama 3.18 billion which is quite interesting and that is what i am very keen to test out in this video okay let's go back and then you can see that all the prerequisites are done let me clear the screen. Next up, let's install and launch Jupyter Notebook so that we could download the model and then play around with it in the browser in more user friendly way. So let's wait for it to get installed and downloaded. Should not take too long. And my Jupyter Notebook is launched and now. So I have imported the libraries which we have installed. Next up, let's get our Hums 3 Llama 3.1 model through the pipeline of transformers and that is going to download the model plus its tokenizer. It is now downloading the shards. So let's wait for it to get finished. And the model is downloaded with its tokenizer. Next up, let's try to get the inference done. So you see that we, here I am just specifying a chat template with this chat ML 
and then we are piping it through the pipeline to get the output from the model and for starters i'm just going to go with a small question that what is the smallest country in the world and there you go the answer is spot on that the smallest country in the world is vatican city okay let's try to ask it a bit more harder question which is filled by most of the models but the original llama 3.1 was spot on so i am asking it write 10 sentences ending with the word beauty let's see what this model does and there you go so it was able to answer few of them maybe just a couple of them but most of it uh, most of the sentences are not ending in the word beauty so i would call it a fail here but other than that if you look at the coherence and the way sentences have been created that is actually quite good so the prose is really high quality but it failed to follow the instruction in this one okay so let's try to see another one i'm just going to paste it here now in this one i'm asking it how many r's are there in the word strawberry so you see it was able to identify it correctly that there are three r's it's not a multilingual model but let's try to see if it can translate english into other languages so i am asking it translate i love you in arabic hindi french korean and urdu let's see if it is able to do that so there you go arabic looks fine hindi looks fine french is korean and then you know what all of them are really spot on so even if it doesn't say that it's not multilingual but i think it is inheriting that from the awesome llama 3.1 okay in the next one let's ask it a reasoning question in this one i'm just asking it that a bat and a ball together cost one dollar ten cents the bat costs one dollar more than the ball how much does the ball co cost so let's see and that is totally correct so what it has done is it has given us the answer straight up which is five cents the cost of the ball and then it has uh, told us its reasoning that it is denoting the ball step by step it is going through and then it is also then deducing that the ball is costing five cents really good stuff okay in the next one i am just trying to see how the role play is so in this the prompt is a spanish speaking customer carlos is visiting a japanese restaurant in the us and then it is talking with the waiter now what this prompt is doing it is trying to check out um, the model's capabilities to understand spanish japanese culture and the american culture nuances as well as responding appropriately in english or spanish so let's try to run it and see what model does here and there you go so it has very appropriately answered it spanish and if you translate it it is spot on really good stuff okay so that done let's try to see if it is censored or uncensored i'm just going to ask it a sort of a um, perverse question so i'm just asking it what are some ways to be consistently negative let's see what it does there you go so it seems it is quite uncensored because lama 3.18 billion the original one just doesn't answer these sort of things but it is telling us how to be negative and it is quite a good advice you see comparing oneself to others dwelling on past mistake avoiding positive experiences um, focusing on negative outcomes receiving to adapt engaging in negative thought avoiding self-care that is quite good okay awesome stuff so it seems it is uncensored so really good for role playing and story writing let's try to see how the math capabilities are it's a simple equation the correct answer is 20 here so let's see what model does let me go down there you go so you see the answer is totally correct next up let's check out the coding capabilities i'm just going to ask it that write a ruby script that reads an array of integers and prints the sum of all positive numbers there you go so it's a perfectly written ruby script yep and then towards the end it is giving us the synopsis of the script too awesome stuff so coding seems really good and this is what we have found with hums models before that coding is always uh, paramount 
and by the way this is a full model it is the quantize one uh, it is not the quantize one which i am showing you on the screen okay so that's it guys i hope that you enjoyed it let me know what do you think about this if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel if you're already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching